Hello everybody, this is Granny. About a year ago, I did a video about a place in Tacoma called the B&I. The B&I first started as a hardware store in 1946 by the owners Irwin and Bradshaw. Over time, it became something much more. The owner started adding things that were non-hardware items. In 1948, they added a carousel, and then an elephant, and some chimpanzees. Around that time, it became known as the G&I Circuit Store. In the 1960s, they began adding well-known celebrity uh, appearances. Much to the delight of the local kid population, they had such famous people as Sheena, Queen of the Jungle, Burt Ward from the Batman Show, and the boxer Joe Lewis. My husband was a child at the time, and the one he remembers the best was the Cisco Kid. But it was Ivan the Gorilla that made the store famous. I know it's very controversial, but Ivan was a, a Tacoma resident and lived in his enclosure at the B&I for 28 years. Where we're driving right now is on South Tacoma Way, which is part of the International District of Tacoma and uh, it's where D&I is located. In 1994, animal activists uh, succeeded in getting Ivan moved to the Atlanta Zoo, where he lived until he died in uh, 2012 during a, a surgical procedure. In 2016, Tacoma honored him with a bronze statue outside their Tacoma Zoo, and uh, I'll show that to you later. Over the years, the store has changed quite a lot, and now it is uh, not what it was back in the 60s. But it is a, an interesting place to visit, and uh, recently it was closed down. Uh, we're waiting to see if it will be opened again. There were a lot of code violations. The carousel is still there, and the pet shop. Uh, all the stores are independently owned and run. There are no uh, big chain stores here. But it was a fun place to visit. One of the uh, most interesting places to visit in the store is their wall of memories. My husband has lived in this city all his life, so he remembers a lot of the uh, things that are pictured here. And was even there on the day that Cisco Kid uh, made his visit. He tried to find himself in this picture, but I think he was just outside the view of the camera. And of course, there are a lot of articles, pictures, and uh, newspaper clippings from the time when Ivan was a resident. They even conduct tours uh, through Ivan's enclosure, or at least they did. On this Christmas fall day, back a year ago, we 
took a drive over to the zoo to see the the statue of Ivan that had been newly uh, installed. This is Point Defiance Park, uh, where the zoo is located, and uh, the statue is just outside the zoo entrance. The statue was uh, created by a local artist and shows uh, Ivan looking at a flower that he found. This was from pi some pictures taken uh, when he was released into his enclosure at uh, the Atlanta Zoo. That's all for today, so goodbye.